Hey, what is going on guys? Welcome to the channel. I am excited to finally be able to share with you Days Gone. I've been talking about it for a few weeks now and well more than that, but just uh, you know leading up to it. So don't want to waste any more time. Just want to jump into it really quick. I'm really excited about this and you know some of the early gameplay we've seen you know two or three days ago that's came out of just some of the open world stuff has been pretty cool. So let's go ahead and just jump into it and get going and see what we find out and I'm expecting high hopes and stuff for this, so let's go with normal. I don't want to do easy, but we don't. Sure, I'm not sure what hard is. If it's anything like World War Z or something, hard would be insane. It's loading up. Yeah, the little ring at the bottom looks pretty cool. I mean, the graphics are really clean on it just for that little loading uh, thing spinning at the bottom, so. I saw earlier um, on YouTube people are sharing, you know, the soundtrack and stuff to the game, and the soundtrack by itself is amazing, so pretty cool. Now with this game, it came with one disc. It didn't come with two discs like Red Dead Redemption did, um, but at the same time, I know that had a lot of extra stuff that was going to be for online possibly too, so um, that doesn't mean Days Gone won't have it. It could just be a download, so no big deal with that at all, you know, so we'll see. Just waiting. Oh, we're just jumping right into the middle of it. Wait, we need help. She's been wounded. What's wrong with her? Well, she's not. Whatever the hell's going on out there, she's been stabbed. I can't take anymore. Oh, okay. Listen, O'Brien. If we don't get her to a hospital, she's going to die. There are no more hospitals. Oh, come on. No more hospitals. You got uh, doctors, you got triage, you got a mass unit. Oh, look, I'm just a grad student, okay? I, I got volunteers for this. I'm not even supposed to be out here, okay? Brian. Okay. Uh, I've only got room for two of you, okay? Two. Why you got room for two of you? We're overweight, okay? I can only take two of you, two. The cutscene graphics look really good, though. Come on, help me, come on. Which I know we saw those in a lot of the trailers and stuff, but still, the final project looks really good, though. You're gonna be alright. I got her. Let's go. We gotta get on that gun. We gotta get on that ship. I heard what he said. There's only room for two on that chopper. Go. Go with her. I'll be okay. Has a good vibe to it, though. Shit in this before. Yeah. Here we go. Where are you going? What? Where? Where? Refugee camp, west of Three Finger Jack. No. Bruiser is never gonna make it without me. Oh, that's the ring from the loading screen. I want this back. You coming? If you play this game, definitely use headphones. It's it's pretty cool. Deke. 
I don't know if I could have la uh, not left. <laughs> it's a pretty good friend, I guess. What did you do? I let her go and stay back. Has a really cool feel to it, though. Just a little bit into it. Two years later. That looks pretty cool. You always gotta have the creepy, like, stuffed animal in the road or something. It's not a zombie thing without it. We lost him. He can't be far. Wait, hold on. Cut your engine. <coughs> oh, shit, she's lost. Oh, she's tore up. Alvarez. Alvarez, hey. Alvarez. What happened here? I mean, who did this? Was it. Was it Rippers? Rippers. I thought the zombies were freakers. Maybe somebody else, another group. Leon did this. Apparently, because I don't think the zombies would call it Leon. Leon. It does really feel like it has a good build up of the story, though. Okay, we're controlling now. R2 to accelerate. Alright. X to boost. That's kind of cool. Take a little bit to get used to. There's a little bit of a sway to the bike, but... Not bad, it just takes a little bit to get used to, so... I know, basically, these are always kind of an open tutorial when you're learning the game anyway. They always put a story with the game, so that's expected, so. It's pretty cool, though. Oh. Probably be good to follow him. Whoa. It feels a little loose, but not in a bad way. Like I said, it just takes to get used to. The environment looks really cool, though. Kind of curious to see how the open free roam is, though. It's just a little bit of plated already. I really like it. Frickin' tree! Oh. <laughs> there we go. Where to go? Where to go? Where to go? There we go. You like that? Yeah. We got him, though. You son of a bitch! You we'll him. catch him. Good thing there's a waypoint on the mini map in the bottom right. We'll catch you. There he is. <laughs> that tree jumped in front of me, so. If you drift while turning, you can slide through corners and even donuts. Do donuts. Cool. While on bike, holding X. Okay. Cover me right behind you. Kind of cool that there's two guys usually in these like kind of games like this that has it to where it's just one guy all by himself so okay tracking press r3 oh okay now oh, you gotta hold it down okay cool where the 
hell's he going? There isn't shit out of here. But okay, you can see the footprints and stuff. That's cool. Maybe I was wrong. Uh, crouch. No, Leon's been fencing shit to Copeland for a long time. Finally caught up with him. That's kind of cool. That's not real blocky hey, looking when he runs through. Okay, clues. Okay, cool, cool. Wait, wait. Hold up, hold up. Shit. All right, let me see. Okay, that's cool. Wait, wait, wait. Here. Down this way. That's pretty cool. Trash it shows fresh. a reenactment, basically. So where the hell did you learn to track shit anyway? It's cool. It's got the footprints there. Anyway. It's, it's pretty cool. Ended up tracking shit for miles. I like it. Oh, that was crazy. Get down. Son of a bitch can't aim worth a damn. This son of a bitch. The mini map on the right's a little bit different. Must be heading down there. What is that? He's losing a lot of blood. Oh crap. Far. Come on. <laughs> There's a freaking ton of them on the bridge. Where'd he go? I'll climb jump. That's pretty crazy. Search him. <laughs> Bleeding out. Well, that's a hell of a way to go. It's slow. A lot of pain, but I suppose you'd know all about that. She was right still now. breathing when we found her, you piece of shit. I wasn't gonna waste a bullet not on her. Hold oh, on for a second. Hold on for a second now. Where's the stash, Leon? If you tell us, well, unlike you, I can promise you we'll make it quick. Don't look like you'd be suffering for too long. That would freak Leon, me out. You got a little problem here, see? They can smell your blood from all the way down there. What do you suppose that feels like? Huh? The voice actors are really good. That is actually one of the things I was kind of concerned about, especially after playing games like Red Dead Redemption 2, how good that was. No, wait. It seems pretty good, too, just like it. All right, all right. No, no. Seems really good, actually, not pretty good. I got it right here. Take it. Where? In the cemetery. It's in the old cemetery. Thank you. No, you said... Do it. Don't leave me out here, man. Do it. Do it. You goddamn liar. Do it. Take it. Tuck's gonna need something for the bounty. That's pretty crazy. You did the right thing, bro. I like it. The, the gameplay me. looks close I to actual just cutscenes, so. Did he stop? Where'd he go? I don't know if I was supposed to follow him or just go or go back to the motorcycle. What's he doing? Come on. Search this camp, see if I can't find something to fix up this scratch. All right, let's see what we got. Oh, something right there. Sterilizer. Let's see what else. Something right there. And a rag. <laughs> okay, let's see. Open up the survival wheel. All right. This is different stuff we have. Okay. okay. We don't have anything. So, okay, I guess we got to craft it. So, R1. Okay. Yes. There. 
Okay, that's pretty cool. Guess I won't be losing the arm anytime soon. That's cool. Yeah, well, it was just kind of, I'm sure it would be, you know, common sense, but it even showed it or actually healed the guy in his arm, so that's pretty cool. Oh, we were going hunting tonight. Take some bounties to Tucker. Well, not if it's pissing down the rain. Nah, man, we need the camp credits. Got to stock up on supplies. Yeah, okay. I don't want to be out all night, though. I guess I'm going back to the motorcycle. It looks really cool, though. The mini map will take a little bit to get used to, you. though, just because I'm used to different kinds, but it's pretty cool, though. Ram your bike into something hard enough and get hurt. Okay. Son of a bitch. Guess that's a fuel line unless you just piss yourself. A fuel pump. Leon. Yeah, shout out my damn fuel pump. Can we get anything out of Leon's bike? Nah, it's done. <sighs> Look, let's just go back to O'Leary Mountain. We'll head out in the morning, find some parts, and come back and get your bike. No, I think I got a better idea. Why don't we just get it while we're out here? What? Well. His bike's all kind of Mad Max looking. Let's just head over there. What are you thinking? We were going out hunting tonight anyway. Crazy Willie's as good a place as any. Yeah. Okay. Hey, what did Leon give you? Map of some kind. Once we get my bike back, let's head up to the cemetery, look around. Yeah. Okay. So, tomorrow, get the drugs, take them to Tucker, collect on Leon's bounty. Then I say we head north. I assume we'll get to, like, a checkpoint or something or release this, kind of like Red Dead did. Oh, there's one just walking around out there. He's, like, dancing on the car. <laughs> That's that's kind of crazy. Yeah, that one's dancing on the car too. Hold on, It'd be really cool, which I'm sure we probably can. Oh, that don't look good. Set up like this a couple days ago. A bunch of rippers blocked the road with an old truck. Come on, help me move. Uh, rippers must be kind of like uh, saviors and stuff from like Walking Dead, I guess. Okay, pushing vehicles, square. Okay. Ready? Yep. Uh, there's a dead person in there. Oh, crap. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. Okay, square. R2 melee. Oh, that's freaking cool. <laughs> that's crazy. Uh, okay, L, point towards him. All right. Get L to roll. Oh, that's freaking rough. <laughs> the, the fighting's done really good. It's not clunky. That was freaking rough, though. <laughs> That was that was rough. It was awesome though. I'm actually surprised how good the fighting is. So that was pretty cool. Uh, coming up on the old Nero checkpoint. We're almost there. Yeah, dark tunnels are never good. Shit, how you want to do this? 
Blow me your shotgun. I'll walk point. Sprint L3. Okay. <clears throat> Looks like that checkpoint had him backed up pretty good. Yeah, a lot of good it did him. Hell, I'd rather be buried back with the goddamn pioneers. Yeah. Shit. Look at them all. Bunch of goddamn dumbasses, the lot of them. What are they thinking? Hey, Mr. Fed, can we sit here and wait till the goddamn horde comes through and just kills us all? <laughs> Bad way to go out, trapped in a shithole like this. Oh, can you check cars? Oh, that's cool. Crafting scrap, ingredients. That's cool, I wouldn't even notice that if that wasn't glowing like that. Yeah, these are one of these games. I didn't do this with Red Dead Redemption 2. I kind of just went so quick through it. And then I had to play through again. Well, now I'm not completely through the second time. And I know I missed so much. So I need to just take my time. So what did we get? Oh, so we got... Let's go ahead and craft that real quick because we might... Oh, we still need more materials. Okay, we got sidearms. Okay, we'll get going. We'll get going. Just want to make sure to check all these different things. I like that. It looks freaking cool. Oh, there's something over here. Where's those triangles on? I don't know what the triangle's been. They haven't showed us yet. This could be a mistake, so. <laughs> oh, that's where they were. Crap, I'm glad I came over here. I would have missed that. I knew I'd seen triangles, but I couldn't get to them. Guess it picked up both at the same time. Okay, cool. I'm glad I came over here. I would have walked right past that. Like I said, this is a game you definitely want to take your time on. Because it's definitely going to be a supply driven game. And there's going to be all kinds of stuff you can miss. You smell that? Oh, Jesus. Ooh. There. Come on, let's go. Wait, hold up. How many Molotovs you got left back here? Let's hit it on the way back. Leave it. Yeah. Leaving my ass. There you go. <laughs> Molotovs, you gotta have them. So far, I like the character Deacon, though. He's not corny, he seems pretty cool. Sounds like a big wish. Boozer, too. That looks freaking cool. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's dead. You're gonna break my shotgun. <laughs> yeah. The graphics look like really good close up. Sometimes I've seen games like this and the eyes look like they're floating behind the face and stuff. Like they're in two separate layers. It looks really good though. You're going up there again. What are you talking about? Yeah, Goddamn reloading. refugee camp. You only act like this when you think about going up there. Act like what? It's not your fault that she's dead. Drop it. If you'd gotten on that chopper with Sarah, all that would have changed is she'd be dead too. Oh crap, she must have died then. 
Or at least they think so. Ah. Is that cards or something? Okay. Uh oh, it says swarmer ear. I guess he cuts the ears off or something when you go by him. I guess he just automatically does it. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> oh, let me see. I like that everything isn't just obvious. You have to kind of watch out and be careful and look for things. Even though you can miss stuff, I like that everything's not just done for you. You got to search the stuff out yourself. It makes it a good game because it's not just so quick you run through it, like melee attacks and stuff. Let's go in this one too. There's something. Could be out in this hallway though. Yeah, it's over there. You're not getting your bike through there. Try that service tunnel. See if you can clear us a path from the other side. I got it. Just keep your headlight pointed that way. I guess the triangles mean like it's in a different room or pretty much. It's not in the same area you're at, so that kind of makes sense than when, what I saw earlier. Okay. <laughs> uh, let's look at this way first. Okay, cool. and see if we craft some things real quick just so we have them. Okay, we got two bandages we can use now at least. I like the wheel. It's real easy to navigate. Oh, crap. <laughs> Yeah, I scared the crap out of me. <laughs> yeah, that's why I just noticed XP and stuff pops up. Freaking crap. Another reason to use headphones, though. What do we got over here? It's kind of cool how you can craft things, though. It's like a lot like Red Dead and stuff, but I mean, it's a cool concept, though. So either way, I think that's it. We'll go back down the other way. I think this is where, yeah, that's where it came in. Yeah, we gotta go this way then. Got turned around. Oh. 
Oh crap. Deep. I didn't plan on this, god damn it. I like that it's free aim, but it 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 flows real well. Oh crap. I like that at least giving you some stuff to start off with though because otherwise it would feel like impossible. <laughs> I think there's some scrap out of that engine we can get. Crap. Didn't mean to do that. Here we go. Oh, here we go. It's this car. This triangle's throwing me off a little bit. I don't think we've been in here yet. No. Nothing there. Bloody footprints, so. Cool. See, like I said, I could have just accidentally just kept going. I would have missed. Oh, crap. Hung itself. So there's a map, skill menus. That's pretty cool, you can go through all that like that. Cool. Just wanted to check the menus and stuff just to see what what all we can do. I didn't want to pass anything up. That's shining, is that no, you can't pick that up. Anything else in here? That's crazy how that would have just been there. They put that in the game and I could have just walked right past it. Yeah, let's go back out this way then. Gotta get her ears. Kind of curious what the ears are for, though. <laughs> Hopefully it's not like a necklace, that'd be corny and just copying off Daryl. Oh. Yeah, I smell it. Oh. That's weird, they How actually make like a nest. You, oh. you just used the last one. You got any shit to make more? Yeah, yeah. Okay. This'll just take a sec. Okay, cool. That'll do it. Got to push on it to kind of expand it. I got it. All right.
equipped. And let's throw it. Ready? It's weird they actually make nests. Get on. Yeah, okay, give me a sec. That's really weird. It's a cool concept, it's something different you haven't seen done with zombies. That that create nests. I've been thinking about what you said about riding north. Just saying, you need to get away from here. Clear your head, you know? In the morning, let's turn in the bounties and we'll hit the road. Hell yeah, brother. Now you're talking. Guess the bounties are the ears. And the hat. I guess the hat was from the guy, though. I don't know if that's what he's talking about, or if the bounty was just for Leon himself. So. Wanted a freak show. Shit. Place is crawling. Freaking crap. Seems like a mix between World War Z and uh, I Am Legend a little bit. They're like eating each other, that's crazy. Shit, we're gonna need more ammo. What are you thinking? And I already know it's a bad idea. You just ride on through. You pull as many of them off as you can. And I just, I go in through the back, down that hill, find the garage. Shit. All right, you just give me a few minutes to find the part that I need. You ride back, we ride the hell out. After I kill a few of the bastards. I swear to God, you got a death wish. <laughs> That's crazy. Like I said, not tonight. How you stinking son of bitches? Come on, that's right. Here I am, motherfuckers. <laughs> that guy's crazy. Found the world. Yeah, that's right. Stay up there. Everyone is fine. There we go. Could be pointless getting up here, but I have no idea. Okay. Takes a little bit to get used to, though. Yeah, I want two by four instead of a table leg. I mean, it was cool to get that for the Molotov, but I don't know if it's worth what we went through to get to it. Okay. 
suppressors. Oh, that's kind of cool. That's kind of cool. There's tons of stuff in there. At least it looks like there should be. There. That's it in there. Looks so we gotta go ahead and just go room by room. <laughs> oh, that's not going to go well at all. Fight or flight. Definitely one of those. Freaking crap. <laughs> no self combination. Oh, 
Oh crap. Oh, okay, we got the combination now. Oh, baseball bat. I don't think there's anything else in here. Let's check the bathroom. Extractor. Is it in throwables? Okay. There's a bunch of them right out there. <laughs> you could jump in the dumpsters. in the garage. So there's going to be some crap in here. I just know it. Keep hearing them and stuff. It sounds like they're like right outside. Oh, I got max scraps, so don't need any more of that crap.
I need the baseball bat though. While we're here real quick, I want to see, I think you can craft, what is it, the Molotov. Yeah. I guess I'll keep this with me and keep running into him. I always come back and get that. I'm not sure if there's going to be a need for it right away. I know this is where we came in, but just want to leave that door open in case I got to run in there. That looks like it's put there for a reason. <laughs> well, I apparently can't jump up on that. Probably a course right there where that frickin' thing's at. Of course. So creepy, that's like kids. I guess there's probably an easier way. I probably could have got across over there. It's nice that they're not really like hold back on supplies. They're actually giving you a good amount of stuff to find. That's good, bad though, because you're probably going to use it. So, scrap. Let's see what's over here real quick before we go back. I think it was to the garage. It's a garage there. What's this? Oregon. Let's go back over here real quick before I go out there. I 
Yeah, I figured so. There'd be band-aids and stuff in there. Didn't want to miss it. Gotta be a fuel pump in here somewhere. It's really cool. It just takes a second to kind of get your bearings about how it operates and the controls. But the survivor wheel and stuff like that is really cool. Just took a second to figure out how they expand everything. Kerosene. The controls handle really well, too. Got more scraps or... Yeah. Probably going to pull one off that bike, I bet. Let's see what's in here real quick. Yeah, there are different types of scraps, so I guess. The ones in the engines and stuff are completely different from the random ones you find. Yeah, there we go. I figured we'd probably pull it off a bike or something when we got here. Boozer, you there? I found the part. I'm heading out to the highway. That's probably Rippers. not good at all. <laughs> Those men? God damn it. Hang on, Boos man. I'm coming. Oh, freaking crap, man. These tats are dead symbols of a dead man. Dead symbols of the lost. Get off me! The bitches! Freaking crap. You must be brought low, biker man. For you are lost. It's like the freaking version of the whisperers and they're freaking freaking insane. I'm not one of the fouls. You are the lost. Yeah. Uh, crouching next to it. Okay, cool. Oh crap, man. I didn't see him in there. It's coming down the road. Okay. Come Don't look at it. God damn it. I'm serious. Don't look at it. Don't look at it. Get on the bike. Go, go. you wait out here let me make sure it's all clear screw that there's a bunk calling my name all right pretty much like we left it what not like there's much to steal 
Yeah, I recognize this from the trailer. Reintroduce myself. At least this area. Oh. oh, thank God. I'm gonna go out, find some shit for your arm, get my bike. Are you gonna be okay? Yeah. Good. Yeah. I'll head over to that neuro checkpoint. They gotta oh. have sterile bandages oh, and painkillers. Don't, don't leave my bike there. It's crazy just how that has oh, the sweat, the sweat and the uh, blood and stuff leaking out. down and stuff. Just how good it's done. Hey, I've got some ammo if you need it. And the footlocker by the door. Thanks. Hey, don't take my shotgun. Uh, Boozer. I... All right. Thank you. Thanks, brother. Just feel kind of naked without it. So, guys, uh, I think I'll probably end the first video right here. Um, it's a really good start, just kind of get the bearings of the game. Um, right away, there's no, nothing I could even complain about at all. Just getting used to the mechanics of it, and yeah, I mean, I'm I'm really impressed with it. The, the graphics are amazing. The story seems really good. Um, you know, even their take on the zombies and stuff isn't predictable. I mean, zombies are still zombies, but like the whole nesting stuff, it's 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 different. I'm looking forward to just kind of seeing how this goes, but. Yeah, if this is your first time here on my channel, I'd appreciate it if you would, you know, like this video and share it with your friends also to subscribe to the channel, click the notification because I do live streams with different types of games and I'll continue doing a, I guess, a let's play walkthrough of uh, Days Gone. So as always, guys, I'll catch you next time in the next video. I uh, look forward to seeing what else this story has.